once stopped me in the service state the server when I was filling my car up one day and he said, mate, you look like Sebastian Vettel. And I said, oh, really? And, and I pulled it up on my phone. I said, yeah, I'll, I'll do a little bit. And I actually went, was walking into a shopping centre one day and there was a, um, a cut-out figure of Sebastian Vettel. I got a, I got a photo next to it and so we sort of did look the same. He is a little bit bigger than me, but um, yeah, yeah, definitely similar features. Yeah, definitely. I grew up in... Um, Country Victoria, basically, so a small place called Turin. Um, I'm pretty fond of. I like to love love my home city of Turin. So um, it is um, the largest uh, uh, asparagus producing in the southern hemisphere, so which is pretty cool. Um, living out in Turin is about 40 minutes anywhere near close to going to school. So I went to school in uh, in Berwick. Um, it was close to my training environment, so I trained. Call the bus to school. Call, um, call the bus to training and. I remember a few of those few of those times I was falling asleep on the bus on the way to school and, and after training and um, it'd be someone waking me up saying like mate you, you gotta get off here. <laughs> I take Kate, Tim and Marty from the Nova show. Um, they drive me home every night from training so I'm big fans of Kate, Tim and Marty. <laughs> um, well we'd, we'd have just a classic sausage sizzle definitely. I'll grow a beard like a pretty heavy beard in a good week. Always wanted to try skydiving or bungee jumping just that through I um, was lucky I did a uh, 10 meter diving platform the other day and I thought it was pretty cool so that 10 meters compared to a, whatever you're jumping out of a plane that'd be um, it's a pretty unreal feeling. <laughs>